Leo, let's test out our yeah. um, our delay. Cool. Of how quick it takes you to respond. Are you ready? Yeah. Yep. I'd, I'd rather have a bow, love. Coco pops. That's pretty good. That's like I have second. no idea what you just did. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Coco. Should we have a go at this? Hello, welcome to the new Easy English show, not podcast. Whoop, whoop. Woohoo! Uh, my name is Mitch. You might recognise me from Easy English episodes that uh, we've been recently making on our own channel. And to my left, to your right, is Easy. Why should I look? So many cameras. Hello! Yeah, you know, we've got all the setup. We've completely destroyed the bedroom to make, uh, yeah, probably a terrible studio in most people's eyes. <laughs> uh, you've probably recognised Easy as well from Easy English, obviously. You've oh. had some small roles. Always Mrs. Easy, yeah. Mrs. Easy. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Uh, but you are also part of Easy German. If you learn German, you might know. Do some German. Moin moin. That's <laughs> good. Uh, so, yeah, this could be a disaster, really, right? This could all go horribly wrong. I have no idea what we're doing here. You prepared everything, so... Yeah, and prepare is a very strong word for what I've done. Um, uh, yeah, so for people who are watching, you will just see this as a video, but if you would like, you can also go to the Patreon page... Uh, which is in the description somewhere, and you'll be able to sign up to become a member, and within that membership, you'll be able to download a transcript of this entire episode. Show. So the more I talk... The show. Oh, the show. The it's show. not a podcast, it's a show. <laughs> so the more I talk, the more work I have to do. Yeah. So if we can keep... Calm down. Yeah. If we can keep <laughs> language down to a basic minimum, then my workload <laughs> is very easy. Um, there's also a dog in the background you might hear, which is our dog Nola. We've had to use a washing line, no, like a washing rack, rack yeah. to stop her coming in and like eating the cables. So now she's trapped outside like a prisoner and she's actually eating, I think she's eating the door frame. Well, we know later then. So yeah, <laughs> we might, yeah the, a carpenter will have to also be paid at some point. <laughs> You have to mention uh, about that audio download. Yeah, so you can also, if you don't want to, you know, if you want to ride to work on your bicycle and or if you want to take public transport or, yeah, however you want to get to your office. Your office is probably your home at the moment. <laughs> uh, and for a disclosure, before I go into the audio download, uh, I want to make a house rule that we don't mention um, the C word. What is that? Oh, all right. Um, but what we can call it, we can refer to it as the pandy, because it pandy. sounds fun and friendly. But it's not fun and friendly. It's not fun and friendly, but I feel like people will want to watch this uh, as uh, some sort of comic relief to the pandy. Uh, I have to think about doing this. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so we can't refer to it, but if we have to, if we must, then it must be referred to as the pandy. Mm. Uh, okay, so yeah, there's also an audio-only download you can get through the Patreon, through Patreon, sorry, and yeah, you can just like, um, on your phone, click a link and you can just listen to it, yeah, on the bus, on the bike, on the tube, however you, you get to work. Yeah. Okay, so, um... Let's start this. Woo, let's start this. So it wouldn't be a, a modern-day podcast show, whatever this is, without having a guest... Leo, ooh, press ooh. the unmute button. <laughs> and me. Uh, <laughs> oh my God, that our, was our loud. guest today is a really good friend of mine called Leo. We, can I say your last name? Yeah, if you want. I'll fit, say your full name, Leopold O'Brien. Hello, Leo. Hey. Hi. Hello. Hi. Thanks. Thanks Hi. for um. Thanks for having me. Ah, thanks for being a part of this. I um. 
I chose you because I thought, and I asked you to do it because I thought you'd be a great addition to our, to make a great trio, a trifecta. Oh, I love it. <laughs> a tripod. <laughs> exactly. Now, Leo, can, uh, for, I mean, people don't really know me or you, I feel like, anyway, but we can, pe- we, people will get to learn about us throughout these episodes because we're going to try and do more and more if they are popular. But Leo, for the moment, because we don't know if we can sign you up to do more, could you tell <laughs> um, people about yourself, please? Yeah, um, my name's Leo. I'm uh, 32. Um, I like um, comic books, um, records, um, football, TV and films. I'm a massive Spurs fan, um, which is... Well, which, which, which is, it tends to be like heartbreaking at the time. There's a lot of hope, and then a, and then a, a, a lot of crushed dreams. Um, <laughs> but that's, that's part of the fun. Um, I live in London. Uh, I grew up with Mitch back in Hampshire. Um, that that probably that's that's uh, probably me. Good segue that's, to hmm. me. That's there it great. is. There you go. Yeah, we. Uh, I think maybe I knew. No, I definitely. We we were like friends at school, right? But we knew each other before yeah. because we studied the fine art, the fine craft oh. of martial arts. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. We are South Korean representatives of their <laughs> martial arts. I saw videos. Oh, oh yeah, classic. <laughs> and can you still um, count to ten in South Korean? Or in Korean? No, I get it. I get it confused with like German, like um. Really? <laughs> yeah. That's because exactly. because I can't I can't remember. Um, no, I I can't even remember how it starts. No, like if if you say <laughs> the first, well, if you say one, and then I I might be able to get Hannah the rest from it. No. Yeah. No. Hannah Hannah Du. No. Yeah, that's right. Hannah, do- How do you know that? Because I also... Uh, a yeah. set? Yeah. No. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, it's... Really? Yeah. Hannah <laughs> going. Set. Believe in yourself. Wheat, tassel, <laughs> yarsel. Am I, am I making that up? No, no, you, I don't know where... I believe you everything. From. I don't know <laughs> any Korean. <laughs> Hannah, good. do, set, net, yeah. tassel, yeah. yarsel. Yeah. Yeah. Um, it, this one's a weird one. Oh, Man, this is uh, an English podcast. And <laughs> with yeah. the oh, Germans, God. Korean. Hello to set. Do you know what? I can only do it by I, doing... I, 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 can't, oh, <laughs> I can only do it by doing, doing um, punctures in there. Yeah, yeah. That's what we used to do every day. Hana, no, yeah, yeah. yeah, Hana, do, set, net, tassel, yasel, ilgop, yadel, ahop, ya. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I don't remember those, those last four at all. <laughs> so, um, recently, Leo, I'm not sure if you watched it. I hope you did, as a friend. We made an episode about job interviews. Oh, uh, I saw the picture, but I didn't see... I, I've not yet clicked the um, clicked on the actual link. You're kind of a bit like like, like that or something with the camera, aren't you? That's right, it's, yeah. It's like, yeah, yeah. So it, the episode was about like what to expect and how to prepare for a job interview. And it was kind of like a what not to do, I guess you'd say. Mm-hmm. Um, and I thought it'd be quite funny to talk about maybe if we know, if you get off the top of your head, oh yeah. man, the dog is going crazy. Maybe let her in here. Yeah, give Chill. her a little stroke. If I stare at her <laughs> like intense in the eyes, she shuts up. I she, uh, knows rice. she knows I'm off now the right uh, the rice shaker um is taking a back seat <laughs> yeah, we used to shake a, a rice bottle at her face which is a good tip for Hi. any dog owners who don't know how to control their dog <laughs> but it works for about a week before it becomes like a fun toy right? <laughs> yeah so yeah i thought because of the episode i thought we could talk about yeah. off the top of our heads if we know any uh funny job interview stories yeah if, do you one, have one? Yeah. Well, or or it, funny what, jobs. 
Well, we've got plenty of them. T- talk so about like, talk about the Vitacrest one and like. Uh, okay, so so yeah, Vitacrest, the, the, the time started at like six until four in the morning or something ridiculous. No, it started at nine p.m. The job. Uh, it started nine, at nine, 9 p.m. PM. And it finished. And what like, time yeah, did we finish? It was like five or six a.m. It finished. Yeah, and and like I just remember thinking, oh, I don't really want to do that, but <laughs> but at the but but at the same time, it was kind of like, well, we'll do it because it will. Be, it would be a funny story. No, no. It and was more that your bank balance said, you will do that. <laughs> you will do it. <laughs> That's what it was. There was I, no I, funniness I, about it. <laughs> you will do the job. I don't, even, I don't even remember if they like paid time and a half or something because it was, <laughs> no. because it was oh, after yeah, hours. Did. No, they did, but only on if you worked Sunday night. <laughs> Um, so like, so like, anyway, so like, um, so we took the, the actual job, and like, I, I, I remember the job agency saying to us, um, "Dress warm because it's like a freezer." Yeah. And and I was like, okay, uh, I don't really know how to take this, so I just put on like an extra hoodie. Yeah, yeah. So like, anyways, so we get there, and um, and you've got to put on. Um, what was it? A wellies, yeah. and a hair net, yeah, hair, wellies, hair net, and then basically a a dress. Suit. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Um, and you I'm, had to kind of dress a bit like some sort of weird psychopath, like some yeah, sort of psychopathic pro- murderer. You probably got a picture somewhere, which oh yeah, we'll put a picture put right now of yeah, yeah. me and you in our <laughs> dresses, <laughs> looking oh, yeah. like uh, what's his name from Psycho? Yeah. Norman Bates um, yeah. <laughs> doesn't need the knife. I thought what we could do now is we could look at some English news yeah. uh, that's been going on. Oh dear, very good before the end of the year. Yeah, I mean, I don't want to talk about anything pandy based, but I thought we could talk about. I found some oh, articles. So um, the one I found the most interesting, which was a bit of a throwback is there's an article about who remembers Johnny Rotten. Do you, remember, do you know Johnny Rotten? Yes, I know Johnny Rotten. Leo, you know Johnny Rotten. You work in the music industry. Of yeah. Uh, so recently there's an article uh, about, I mean, it's the the title sounds disgusting, but it, the backstory is actually quite heroic. But it, the title is Johnny Rotten Bitten on by flea after befriending squirrels. And is this in the Star or something? <laughs> it's in a certified news article website that I've <laughs> I digged very deep. This is as good as it gets. It says former Six Pistols lead singer John Lydon, who is also goes by Johnny Rotten, it's like a stage name, uh, has revealed he was bitten on his by a flea after he rescued some squirrels. Aww. <laughs> ah. That's quite nice. The 64 year old, also known as Johnny Rotten, says he has flea bites in several parts of his body, no one cares about the other places, after he befriended the squirrels who were hanging around his house on Venice Beach. <laughs> uh, and he, this is a direct. Wait, the quote is good. A direct quote. I don't know how direct this is. I'm sure it's made up. He said, Shall I try and do how he speaks? If you can, yes. The bites. Wow. That's nothing like him. I'm not going to do an impression. The bites. <laughs> wow. Last night was murder because of it. He said, The itching, too. It's such a <laughs> thing to get caught out on. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Who'd have thought? Next. <laughs> we'll drop that one for next time. Okay, so next, this requires all of us to stand. Please stand, Leo. I can't see you because I'm looking at the article. I will pretend to stand. Oh, I've got I will stand. Off. Can we really stand? You don't have to because you're German. And oh, yeah, I'm But asked. the Queen is also German, actually. So you must also stand. I can, I can Leo, stand and put your hand on your heart. Yeah. In the background, there will be the national anthem. Do you want to do it? She is part German. Right. 
That's enough. Sit back down. <laughs> so I have a new story about... I thought this could be called The Royal Minute. And we, we will just discuss the royal family because... Um, people in England don't actually care about the royal family, I find. Other than grandmas, I think, who have china plates of Princess Diana on their dining room wall. So I just thought I'd go into this article I found, which I found quite nice. And it's about Prince Harry and Prince William and about how they grew up. Ooh. And Ooh. It, <laughs> Ooh. Um, it's, a, it's kind of... Uh, the article is called... Um, the funny way Prince Harry teased Prince William when they were kids, according to a royal insider. So it just basically <laughs> more lies, just like the Johnny Rotten <laughs> biting story. Um, when Harry and William used to fight, um, when it used to reach a climax, apparently <laughs> William would always resort to one last... He had like one like ace card to play always, which would... Even when he was a kid, he would always just say like... Um, uh, well, I'm going to be king and you're not going to be king. <laughs> I believe I, that. I, I completely believe that. Yeah, me too. <laughs> I, yeah, what's quite funny is the article talks about like how um, uh, like the, the the staff who used to look after them, it tries to like explain how he used to try to teach them how to be normal. And it's and the guy said that, like, oh, yeah, we wanted to give them like the normal experience as, like, uh, you know what people on the outside world of not being royals would have, and mm. on his list of things he would say that they would they would do together. He says we'd experience things like going to the cinema, queuing up to buy a McDonald's. <laughs> <laughs> I just and that I just find that that's quite hilarious because I almost feel like he's trying to put too much emphasis on the queuing part. Yeah, <laughs> yeah, like, very British. I've never, like, really, I would never say I've had to, like, you have to get in a line for McDonald's, but I want to say it's like a queue. Yeah, it is. No, but why, why put so much emphasis on the queue? <laughs> like, usually they just turn up and just... Maybe they went Saturday morning at 3am when all the drunk people are there. <laughs> yeah, that would be the real experience. Going when everyone's... We queue too. <laughs> no, we're Rose. We Q too. Yeah. <laughs> Hashtag, Hashtag we Q. Yeah. <laughs> I just oh. like the emphasis on that. But I, yeah, the thought of William teasing. He probably still does that nowadays. Yeah. I'm gonna be king, <laughs> and you're gonna be a little peasant prince. Uh, now the little prince is gone. Yeah, mm. it's true. I don't know much about you. You, you have to update us on that bit. On Harry. Yeah. Well, I don't know anything. I've just read that they are not in Canada anymore, but now in the California or so. Oh, really? With Johnny Rotten? <laughs> Saving screen. Hanging out. <laughs> Best buds. <laughs> Flea Britain bit uh, bros. They're at least the most personable ones, aren't they? Yeah, I actually like Harry. Even though he like dressed up as a Nazi, I think yeah, that shows that his... A very poor moment of his history. But I think, I think it shows like his human side. Like He, he also makes mistakes. Not that I've ever dressed up as a Nazi. <laughs> <laughs> Next. <laughs> Next subject. Okay, so Leo, yeah. um, I, I gave you some homework. Yes, you oh, did. Yeah, yeah, I'm excited for that. Uh, so um, we asked Leo to watch... I'm just going to make it... I want to see your face as opposed to this article oh. about Johnny Rotten's penis. Like what oh, wow. Right, my voice we'll broke. show you later, Leo. What a mess. Cool. I'm going to take a picture of it so we can see. Uh, we gave you homework, Leo, didn't we? And Yes, you did. Your homework was to... I asked you to watch The Crown. Yeah. Did you watch Just The Crown? Netflix series. You have to oh, yeah. You, you... Can we say Netflix? Yeah, yeah. Netflix. Netflix. Yeah. yeah. Um... It's on a streaming platform. Other royal-based programmes are available throughout. Um... um... But yes, um, give me your uh, review. What did you watch, me, by the way? Did you watch the? So I decided to because there's four seasons. Yeah, I I decided to start from the beginning. Good idea. Um, <laughs> and <laughs> what pro? <laughs> what pro? <laughs> because, because I, I because I thought like genius. I thought like like the. <laughs> 
the the trailer f- uh, for the a new season I saw it and I was like oh wow but that that looks really cool um but but um yeah so I I watched it from the first episode which is like 56 or 58 minutes long wait oh, oh. wait Where's before it? you say something so my sister Kari loves it and my friend or one of my friends as well and they always mm-hmm. want to convince me to watch it can you sell it to me the way that I will tomorrow watch it? This is no. good. I like this. Oh no. Um it's 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 shot really well. Um <laughs> Good review. <laughs> I I I just don't care about the royal family. Would you would you recommend it Sounds absolutely Yeah, yeah I'm I'm not even gonna, I don't ever. know why I'm asking you because I'm for sure not going to watch it after that review. It sounds terrible. If you no, if you if I think the enjoyment? If, you're a, if you're a fan of 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 um of um of the royal family and and um history and uh period period dramas nope um <laughs> then then it, it's 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 going to be right up your alley um but i would i would rather well i don't even really want to watch a documentary but about the royal family um I can't imagine that the 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 pace ever gets above like I I can't even, like the, I can imagine the score just being like harpsichord. And then, oh, would you like a cup of tea? No, I'll have a coffee. And then that's the biggest point of like where the music yeah, can change. There, there was there was like there was like a um um uh leading up to like a little scandal between um the queen's sister having a fling with like um ah, yeah, uh, the the queen's dad's right hand man yeah yeah incest um, is the main thing with royal families isn't it just just really don't care just 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 all of it is just do do not care i mean it's going it was a cute like it was shot really well yeah um yeah give can you give me like and, give me like a three word summary for the se- episode one, season one of The Crown. Three words. Just plain boring. <laughs> <laughs> That's really good, actually. That's like a Peter Bradshaw. Just plain boring. Imagine that on the side of a London bus. The Crown, season one, episode one. Just just plain boring. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so talking about uh, movies... Oh, actually, talk, we're talking about Netflix. Uh, I also thought it'd be fun to talk about English movies because I'm like really obsessed uh, dog update. It ate the entire slipper, and it's actually sw- swallowing bits of the slipper. She thinks she doesn't get enough food here. That's the problem. Yeah, but she's actually got told by the vet today that she's overweight, probably because not of... overweight. He just said she could be thinner. Yeah, let's uh, not. That's all right. <laughs> yeah, but like, um, that's that's. Um, I would say that's because she's. At the moment, she's not allowed to go out for walks at the moment, is she? Yeah. No, no. that's right. Uh, so, uh, Leo, I sent you a yeah. script. So we're, yeah. uh, we're going to now act out uh, a part of a movie, uh, an English movie, and I really recommend you watch it. It's one of my favourite movies. It's called Sexy Beast. And I think I think it's also directed by uh, an English director, uh, but it stars Sir Ben Kingsley... Do you know Sir Ben Kingsley? Which one's he? He played Gandhi. Oh, yes. Oh, yeah. Absolutely. And he's like an amazing character <laughs> actor. Um, yeah. And he plays... And Leo, you're going to play the part of Ben Kingsley's character. And he's called... I think he's just called Don. Don. Cool. Don. Nice. So he is um, the, the head gangster of an organisation. And cool. um, Easy's going to be the like the narrator for this screenplay mm-hmm. and I'm going to play all the other characters which are stewardess and Spanish businessman nice on oh, no, a Spanish biz- business passenger and so this film is just to give you a summary is a film about um, a guy who's retired from the mafia Ray Winston and he's living his dream life I think out in like Greece I think on an island and his boss comes to hire him for one last job and his boss is a complete psychopath. And Leo, you're playing that psychopath. Cool, nice. 
Um, and he basically is, he comes over to convince him for a job. And then the Ray Winston says no. And then the guy is on a, the Don is on a plane. Uh, ben Kingsley's character is on a plane. And he suddenly decides, actually, I'm going to convince him again. So he is on the plane ready to leave. But he thinks in his head, no, Ray Winston's going to do this job for me. And I'm going to get off this plane somehow. So, Leo, uh, actually, no, yeah. I think, easy, you start. So, Don sits as the plane is readying for takeoff, thinking. Oh, what is that? A matronly, is that right? Mat- a matronly. matronly. A matronly Spanish woman, woman in the seat beside him. The voice in Don's head continues. He lights up a cigarette. <laughs> Draw- <laughs> Sound effects. Draws deeply. Thinking. I oh, know. Leo has to do this. Thinking. Yeah, Leo, act this out as well. Nice. <laughs> a stewardess approaches. Sir, I'm afraid you cannot smoke. What? What do you want? Your cigarette. You have to put it out. A cigarette? What this? No. I'm not going to put it out. <laughs> Somehow I sound more Asian. <laughs> you must. Why that? If not, we cannot take off. Well, <laughs> that's your problem, isn't it? <laughs> oh, wait, a friend just texted me. Hold on, it's getting in the way of my script. Oh, God. Sorry, hold hold on to the movie. Say, say the line again, sorry. A line again. Well, that's your problem, isn't it? <laughs> That it's your move. Yeah, you're supposed to... He says it. he smokes, stares up at her, do it. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, sorry. He smokes, stares up at her. She doesn't know what to do. Please. It's your move. Please, please, sir. Nah, I ain't putting... I ain't putting it out. <laughs> you're going to have to wait till I finish. Simple as that. <laughs> he smokes. She goes for assistance. This is me as a Spanish passenger. Look, <laughs> why don't you just put the cigarette out? What's that long nose? <laughs> what? <laughs> do you know? Come on, you know, you're auditioning here. I know, I can't read. <laughs> do you know? <laughs> Do you want me to cut your hand off and use it as an as an ashtray? Stare. <laughs> yeah. I'll oh, put it out, mate. If if you prepared to let me stub it out in your eyeball, I'll put it out. What? And you agreeable? No? He sits back in his seat, smokes. Sees a few stewards and the stewardess coming down the aisle. Thank you. Oh, <laughs> here comes the game bridge. <laughs> Look. Rise us quickly. Rise quickly. Rise. Oh. <laughs> <laughs> you got a blanket. You got a blanket on. <laughs> it's winter, I, isn't it? But that didn't work. <laughs> no. <laughs> Tell you what. Start again, but I'll... you don't have to you don't have to rise quickly. Alright. Oh. Oh here comes the gay brigade. <laughs> Look. <laughs> Tell you what. I'll get, get, get off the plane. Oh, that's my beer. <laughs> wow. Oh, that'd have been amazing. Did you get that... beer right yeah. now? Hang on a minute. Oh. That was so good as well. Okay, <laughs> we're going to end early because the dog is just eating everything. But Leo, your acting abilities are immense. Yeah, you got the job. Thanks. Always knew it. <laughs> you will be done. Uh, Leo, we would love to have you on again because I think it's actually really good fun. And we should keep on doing this movie thing because I really love it. I think it's so much fun. <laughs> yeah, next Just to time. get you to yeah. say the most atrocious things. I'll come up for it. It's, 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 it's been good fun. Say goodbye to Leo. Goodbye, Bye. Leo. Bye. Thanks, mate. Joining in. Do you want me to leave this meeting? <laughs> no, mute yourself. <laughs> mute yourself. Mute yourself. 
Okay, so there you go. That was our first attempt at doing the Easy English show. Oh dear. What a shambles. I need another drink now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. The, the dot made it more exhausting than we thought, huh? Yeah. We need to cage the animal. Cage the beast. Uh, so yeah, like I said at the beginning, uh, definitely head over to Patreon if you want a transcript of the show. The amount of nonsense we talked. It's just us saying, like, down, Lola! Get down! Get the dog! That's all <laughs> it's going to be. Yeah. And to uh, download an amazing transcript of Leo's fine acting work as Don. Yes. Uh, and, yeah, we'll be back in a couple of weeks. Bye! Bye! Leo, thank you. Uh-huh.